Ladies and gentlemen, I just pulled off the best, most astral galaxy brain troll I've ever done in my entire life, and I've got most of it on camera. So, I was doing Rob, the skeleton key boss right here, uh, with my friend, and what we would do is we would start a team up, which you need a key, you need a skeleton key to do that, and once we get a full team and go in, we would just pretend to be AFK and let someone else use their key. You know, it doesn't matter that I've got like 40 keys hidden up my ass. Why would you use your key when you can let someone else use their key? You know, you don't have to spend keys. But one time we got in with a guy named Talon. And Talon was an uh, interesting guy to say the least. He was... Uh, speaking in some manners and terms and he would use capital letters and commas and he would dot every sentence and so this guy was kind of he kind of knew what was going on uh but he still used his key you know and when we queued up again we got in with him again twice in a row so this time uh when he saw us you know familiar faces uh, he was like, no, I don't want to use my key again, now you use your key. And we just didn't want to give him our keys, so he said, okay, let's make a deal then. So we were going back and forth at each other. Uh, basically, he wanted to make a deal where I give him powers and then he unlocks the door. Um, and I was trying to scam him uh, to basically... First he opens the door and then I give him powers. He didn't want to do it, but... I said it so many times, like first you give, first you unlock the door, that he just said, uh, <laughs> he used a term that I've never fucking heard before. Okay, I'll extend an olive branch. What the fuck, man? I'll extend an olive branch. I don't think anyone younger than 50, 60 years old uses that fucking term. Whatever that term is. Let's see if you run in without paying. And so we went in, and the deal was that before the fight, I give him the cards. Um, I didn't. <laughs> I just went in, and we did the boss. And then I trolled him for a bit more, saying, you know, I can still give you the fucking treasure cards. I was, like, hyping him up that I'm gonna give him 50 empowers or some shit. And I swear to god, this guy is literally just a Monty Python character. Like, uh, I, I asked him how much you want, he said, I let you decide, you can offer what you think it's worth. Basically what he said here is like, um, you can compensate me for the emotional damage you've done to me, you know, in Empowers. I'll use the funds to pay for my pet. <laughs> the funds? You know... Uh, he's a pretty weird fucking guy, I've never seen anyone talk like this. Of course I didn't give him the fucking empowers, I just fucking left. And from this point on, Talon hates my guts for the rest of his fucking life. And so Talon didn't want to do runs with me anymore. And he went uh, with the other random guy that was in our party, and the two of them were doing runs on the road. And because Talon didn't hold any grudge against my friend Wolf, uh, Wolf decided to join them while I was plotting my next move in the shadows. But Wolf noticed that Talon kept opening the door, even though he said earlier he does not have any keys left. And he asked him, like, dude, where'd you, like, do you have more keys? How do you have more keys? What Talon did... I'm not fucking joking, by the way. What Talon did is he went to the fucking crown shop, okay, and bought this fucking thing. The skeleton key bundle, where you get... <laughs> this is funny, man. This bundle is so fucking funny. You get three keys, okay? You get three fucking keys for 750 crowns. What? 
I never- I didn't even know this fucking existed. Like, if they gave you, like, ten keys, that would still be a hell of a scam, you know? You can buy two packs for the same amount of crowns and have a better chance of getting a mount drop from that than from doing raw three times with the keys you get from this. He bought a total of 24 keys. Luckily, not bundles, not bundles. He bought 24 fucking keys. That's eight fucking bundles. And let's go to our trusty calculator. That is 6,000 crowns! What the fuck? Nightshade drops that. Jade Oni drops that. Cleopatra drops that. Kraken. 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 Fucking Kraken! Drops the wooden skeleton key. And this fucking guy bought a bundle times eight, okay? That is not okay. So anyway, while they were doing their runs, I came up with the most galaxy brain trolling idea I've ever had in my life. I just quit the game, okay? And just went on another fucking character, this character. And Talon had no way of knowing that that I'm Thomas, you know, that I'm the same guy. And so I just asked my friend uh, to just teleport me in and I did a bunch of fucking runs with them. And so I joined the team and just basically made this guy fuck himself over. You know, he was talking shit about me, you know, about my other wizard. And he said he would never do raw with me again. He, you know, like, Thomas fucking sucks. He's a bad person. Uh, if, you know, uh, he told Wolf, like, if you see Thomas again, uh, tell him he's missing out on all the keys, you know? And the next thing you know, I'm just doing runs undercover with the guy that swore in his mother's grave that he will never share another key with me again. I got the whole thing on camera and he just doesn't stop saying stupid shit throughout the entire session. First he was like bragging about how many keys he has and I intentionally asked him like, oh, what did you farm to get so many keys? Although I know he bought them in the crown shop. He said my card. <laughs> And after that, uh, while waiting for him to do a run of Sapoti for whatever fucking reason, me and Wolf calculated uh, exactly how many crowns he spent on keys. And, you know, we found out what I just told you a minute ago and we, j we were just fucking shocked, you know. So, when we realized just how rich Talon is, uh, Wolf started trying to get him to buy his m memberships, you know. Uh, and while he was doing that, I was trying to make Talon like me as much as possible. Because the more he likes my imposter identity, you know, the more depressed he will feel when he finds out I'm, you know, the dreaded Thomas that scammed him for keys. I even helped him by, like, telling him what skeleton key bosses he should farm I was, you know, sweet-talking him. I was just the best, kindest person possible. I I genuinely seemed like I wanted to be his friend, you know? And a bit later, Talon said he'd run only two more times with us, which pissed me off, because I knew he had more keys, you know? So I asked him, like, why won't he do anymore? And he said, Oh, I have plenty. But I like to save them for a rainy day. What the fuck does that even mean? Dude, this... 
This guy speaks in ways I cannot comprehend. For a rainy day. What the fuck does that fucking mean? So on the last run, you know, we were saying goodbye to each other and stuff like that. And I wanted to use that little time I had left to set up my reveal as much as possible, you know? <laughs> Here I said, man, why do people scam? I don't, I just don't get it. You know, like, oh, because he was, yeah, he was talking to me about this Thomas that scammed him, you know, oh, if, yeah, here he is, Wolf, uh, if you run into Thomas, tell him what he missed, like, tell him he missed a friendship with me. And so now it was finally time for me to reveal myself and make this man commit suicide, basically. It's great having you here. Don't, don't do it to me. I beg you. No. So in case you don't understand how much of a fucking troll this is this guy poured like 15 keys on runs with me thinking we're all like so supportive of his beef towards thomas and now he's just realized he's been in a truman show all along and he's never getting those keys back like i didn't film his response to it but he just said some stupid shit like he always fucking does like he said like well 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 then i won't share any more of my keys and i will just hot foot out of here you know <laughs> and yet by the way he actually said well 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 like i didn't make that up i killed this man here like literally from now on he would just he will be physically alive but he's just a soulless empty husk now you know uh, the funniest thing is that right after ruining this man's life i just hop back on my main fucking character and me and wolf just continue doing raw like nothing happened you know we were laughing so hard dude i and i never felt better that was the best feeling i've ever felt in my fucking life so there's a new devious trolling idea for you, you know? If you want to make someone just lose hope in humanity completely, you just gotta be, like, an asshole to someone, make them, you know, absolutely hate you on one character, and then hop on a different character and sweet, sweet talk to them, be a pleasant person, just generally make them love you, and then reveal that you're actually the guy they absolutely hate and that you were trolling him the whole time and in the process make them you know give you something that they would never give you if <laughs> if they knew who you are like this is just the best trolling formula ever <laughs> 